Hi, Patriot. Twitter's... ...called me to see whether or not, uh, uh, how I felt about it. And I said, look, it can't be controlled for security reasons by China. Too big, too uh, invasive, and it can't be. And here's the deal. Uh, I don't mind if, uh, whether it's Microsoft or somebody else, a big company, a secure company, very, very American company, buy it. It's probably easier to buy the whole thing than to buy 30% of it. I suggested that uh, he can go ahead. He can try. We set a date. I set a date of around September 15th, at which point it's going to be out of business in the United States. But if somebody, and whether it's uh, Microsoft or somebody else, buys it, that'll be interesting. Maybe a deal is going to be made. It's a great asset. It's a great asset, but it's not a great asset in the United States unless they have the approval of the United States. So it'll close down on September 15th unless Microsoft or somebody else is able to buy it and work out a deal, an appropriate deal, so the treasury of the, really the treasury, I guess you would say, of the United States gets a lot of money, a lot of money, okay? Internet censorship in the United States is the suppression of information published or viewed by on the internet in the United States. The First Amendment of the United States Constitution protects freedom of speech and expression against federal, state, and local government censorship. The strong protections for freedom of speech and expression against federal, state, and local government censorship are rooted in the First Amendment of the United States Constitution. These protections extend to the internet, and as a result, very little government-mandated technical filtering occurs in the U.S. Nevertheless, the internet in the United States is highly regulated, supported by a complex of set of legally binding and privately mandated mechanisms. With a few exceptions, the free speech provisions of the First Amendment bar federal, state, and local governments from directly censoring the internet. The primary exception has to do with obscenity, including child pornography, which does not enjoy First Amendment protection. Obscenity. Obscenity. The state or quality of being obscene, obscene behavior, language, or images. In the United States of America, issues of obscenity raises issues of limitations on the freedom of speech and of the press, which are otherwise protected by the First Amendment to the Constitution of the United States. The only reason Trump will ban it is because he hates China and has no actual evidence about TikTok collecting our data. So, and it's also against free speech if he ever chooses to do so. I have a petition here for you to sign on change.org. It's called Save to Talk. And it has about 55,900 signatures already. So if you can just spread the word right now, because we only have 30 days left until the deadline with Microsoft, which is buying TikTok very, very soon. And hopefully the deal is reached by them too. If Trump chooses to ban TikTok, he will violate free speech for all. So, do your diligence and go to the petition right now in the description or in the comment section below and save to talk.